And people are also a little worried that Stuart Roberts has been put in charge of it. Stuart's a very good friend of the Prime Minister. I mean, Government Services Minister. Well, I, I don't want to be unfair to the guy, but he has got things wrong in the past. When? Well, well, when he, uh, he mistakenly charged taxpayers $38,000 for his own internet usage, when he mistakenly accepted a $40,000 Rolex watch from a Chinese businessman, uh, mistakenly breached ministerial standards by having shares in a trust linked to the mining company of a generous Liberal Party donor, uh, when he mistakenly created the impression he was in China in an official capacity for a signing ceremony between a Chinese business and a mining company whose executive chairman was a generous Liberal Party donor, uh, when he mistakenly made his 80-year-old father a company director named his parents home address as the company's principal place of business which looked after tens of millions of dollars worth of government contracts and he was responsible for robo debt and in charge when the mygov website crashed a few weeks back which he then mistakenly blamed on a denial of service attack what's your point well look here he is explaining how our information will be kept private <laughs> sounds pretty reasonable to me he goes on at no point does the Commonwealth get the data at all. And when the pandemic's done, uh, I delete the app and all data from my phone. Uh, and then I, the minister, will blow away the national data store. Uh, and therefore, no data will be kept for individual citizens. That sounds even more reasonable. None of the information goes to him. It's all on his phone. He deletes it when it's all over. And then he blows it away, presumably with one of Bridget McKenzie's shotguns. But I... The takeaway here is that Scott's made it very clear this app is optional. If Australians decide not to share their private data, we'll just go and ask the Chinese government for it. Well, thank you very much, Joe Miller, for coming in all season. Um, and would you please accept, on behalf of Mandis Hell, uh, this? Oh, I'm allergic. Yeah, I know.